Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to Apocalypse News Bits. I'm Jacob Bartley, and I'm here to report on the news that Matt Reeves will be directing the Batman. Now, a few weeks ago, we heard the news that Ben Affleck will not be directing the Batman anymore. He will still be starring in and writing the Batman. And as soon as that dropped, everybody started speculating who was going to direct this film, direct this film, including myself. I threw around some names such as David Fincher or Kevin Smith. Those would have been some choices I would have been happy with. But Matt Reeves is a name that automatically got thrown around. And I got to say right off the bat, this is a great choice. If you don't know who Matt Reeves is, he's directed Dawn of the Planet of the Apes and the upcoming War for the Planet of the Apes. And if you haven't seen Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, I think... This the type of tone he set for that movie is perfect for a Batman movie because you that movie goes really dark and it has elements to where you think oh this movie could be rated R and that's kind of where you, what you want Batman to feel like you want it to feel dark and scary and question whether it's rated R or not but of course it's going to be PG-13 because they need to make money and Batman doesn't need to be rated R there's no f bombs or excessive gore just like in Dawn of the Planet of the Apes so his ability to create that tone in a PG-13 movie, I think is perfect for the Batman. Like I said, he wouldn't be my first choice. I thought there were some better names out there, and if it were up to me, I would still love for Ben Affleck to direct this movie. He's still a great director in my book, even though Live By Night wasn't his best film. I thought, still thought it was a pretty good movie. It just wasn't a Ben Affleck level movie from the like the the standard that he set for himself so far. But overall, Matt Reeves directing. I do think it's a really good choice, and this is a good thing for DC. They've had so much drama from last year with Batman v Superman and Suicide Squad, and the Flash director leaving the movie, Ben Affleck not directing the Batman. This is some good news that we need to hear from DC. It kind of brings some stability to it because you have such a great proven director coming in to direct this film, and I think it alleviates some pressure from Ben Affleck to direct, write, and perform in this movie. Now he can focus on the performance and the script. So I think overall this is a great thing. It's a good sign for DC, and I couldn't be happy pers happier personally. What about you guys? Let us know in the comment section what you think of this news of Matt Reeves directing the Batman for DC and Warner Bros. And thank you all again for listening. I'm Jacob Bartley. You can find me on this YouTube channel. Please subscribe. Hit that like button. Thanks again. Until next time, take care.